Hello and welcome to Sobricks. I'm Adam and this is Sobricks. This is my channel for reviewing Lego sets and building them and other Lego related stuff. In this video, I'm going to be taking another look at the Lego Technic dump truck set. This is set number 42147. It has 177 pieces, and I paid $13 for this set. Now, I've already done a video building and reviewing the dump truck, but as I saw on the box for that set, it said it was a two-in-one, and it had an alternate model. It did not come with the instructions for the alternate model, but those were found online. So, in this video, I am taking apart the dump truck, and then and I am uh, putting together the excavator alternate model and reviewing that. So, for the rest of this video, while I disassemble the dump truck and while I build the alternate excavator model, I will speed the video up and then I'll slow it back down to review the excavator model. So, until then, enjoy! Okay, so that is this Lego Technic Excavator uh, build. This is from the Lego Technic Dump Truck set, set 42147. I've already done a video where I put together and reviewed the dump truck, but on the box it said this was a two-in-one, and there were alternate directions online uh, for this excavator set. So taking the same parts from the dump truck, and using them to build something else. So I took apart the dump truck and put this together. Uh, and this is really great. I really, really like this. I did not expect to like it as much as I do. Um, it's very, very fun. Surprisingly, it did not use all the pieces. I know this is some of the leftover pieces. It may not be all of them, but I just know that between the dump truck and the uh, excavator there was a few leftover pieces which was, I was kind of surprised to see because I would have thought for like a two-in-one maybe they would have tried to use all of them but then when I think about like creator three-in-ones the alternate models uh, don't use all of the pieces that the main model does and this Lego Technic set is no different so I really liked the dump truck I was really glad that it had the steering and I was also I, I really liked the mechanism to um, tilt the bed of the dump truck up to dump its contents and this excavator has some really cool function too so i'm really, really happy with it so it still has the four wheels here uh, it can't turn as easily because there's no steering for the wheels the wheels are all fixed so for play you have to use a little more uh kind of deal there to uh to turn this but the whole bottom can rotate here and the whole top can rotate which means this can you know it can be this can be driven straight somewhere and reach something uh, all the way around it um, so this whole top section can rotate uh, 360 degrees all the way around very very easily and it still feels very very sturdy um, for that and then it has kind of a couple more functionality things here and that's with these levers that you build here and I think these are really great so um, the first one 
is to kind of pull in the bucket mechanism that uh, might um, use to scoop up whatever this is excavating. So this piece here, by pushing this back and pushing this forward, uh, let's see if I can get a better view of that, we can actuate the uh, the bucket of this excavator and then in conjunction with that we can move the whole assembly up and down so we could lift this up and release the bucket bring it down scoop something up bring it up drive away release it you could bring it down and then release it. And I think that's all really, really well done. So I, I had a lot of fun immediately after finishing this, sort of playing with this lever and imagining kind of having it, you know, uh, digging something, lifting it up, driving it away, dumping it down, and then going back and excavating more. And I think uh, those those um you know those details really really help this uh this build i think it's really really nice it doesn't use the stickers in a in a particularly great way although some are are visible here and here uh but they are just in the position that you on the pieces and on the spots that you apply them for the dump truck which makes more use of these stickers i think but these ones here are are nice i did like that the build of this whole I don't know what this this is, but um, this element here, the engine or the whole counterweight or whatever it is, all the kind of construction yellow here is uh, asymmetrical because of the uh, levers here, but also just in the build itself. And then over on this side, if you look at it, we have this, which I believe is supposed to be like the cab with some extra kind of translucent elements for lights up there. And I really like that there's like a cab on one side. It makes this feel even more realistic there. So the build was pretty interesting. I feel like for a lot of Technic, um, the build is asymmetrical because the way you have to fit pieces together, um, kind of you you work around it in a certain way uh and the dump truck is for the most part symmetrical the only parts that were like asymmetrical that i really remember was the mechanism for tilting the bed of the dump truck um but other than that it felt like you could slice it down and and the cross section would be pretty similar um this one's not like that at all so it's pretty unique uh, for me and for this set that is like a 13 dollars set uh, 177 pieces where you get the dump truck with the hand of God steering and the ability to dump stuff and then you get this uh, secondary build for the two-in-one of this uh, excavator I think that's really really great I think that's a really good deal I actually wish and maybe I'll do this is I had another one of these just for play I think this could work really well in conjunction with the dump truck because the excavator could kind of uh, carry some stuff and dump it right into the bed of the dump truck and then the dump truck could drive it off and dump it somewhere else and come back and the excavator could, could excavate some more material and dump it in the bed of the dump truck. And I think that's really, really cool. So it's nice that they like thematically could work together even though they're built out of the same set. And uh, I really enjoyed this build. I enjoyed the dump truck as well. Um, but I think I like this excavator more, actually. Something about these two mechanisms, even though they're super simple, uh, they just feel really, really satisfying for me. I like that there's enough friction in there so that if this doesn't immediately just fall down, it can be like positioned like this and, and be played around with. And that's really, really good. And I just think the mechanism's great. I'm glad this can turn. I like that there's the cab and the asymmetry there. So this was really, really nice. And, um, I'm a big fan of this and I can't, I can't wait to do some more of these kind of smaller, you know, 10 to 13 to $15 Technic builds and two-in-one Technic builds here as I get more familiar with the Technic system. So I really, really enjoyed this.
Um, if you enjoyed this video, consider giving it a like. And if you like the other videos on my channel, consider subscribing to it so you can stay up to date on all the Lego videos I will be doing in the future, including more Lego Technic, and then just a bunch more Lego themes, uh, different Lego sets of all different shapes and sizes and piece counts and price points, tons of stuff coming up. So subscribe so you don't miss any of that. And if you feel like supporting this channel in another way, consider hopping over to the so bricks patreon where not only will you help me uh support me financially but uh, you also get access to some exclusive content over there early access to everything and a bunch more bonuses um over there so maybe consider checking that out every little bit helps and i'm very grateful for all the support so far and i hope to be able to continue to do this and to grow and i just really appreciate um everybody who who's uh, subscribed and likes the videos and watches the videos. So thank you so much. And until next time, thanks. Bye.